We know Kai Bot as an artist, but if we didn't know that, he would be one of the top yachtsmen in France in the 19th century. He was very unusual in the Impressionist group of artists in that he was individually rich in his own right. He was also a sort of Impressionist everyman who was expert not just at painting, but at also the other enthusiasms in his life. Yachting, stamp collecting, gardening. He was at the top of all these pursuits. The Impressionists saw him as a very important figure within the movement. He helped sustain it and he bought many of the great works by his fellow artists, which he later donated or tried to donate to the French state. Kaibot painted several different subjects. He painted uh, town scenes, he painted figure subjects, he painted garden scenes, but he did paint a lot of marine pictures, uh, just shy of 40 in fact, in two different series. This is from the earlier series, painted round about 1881, 1887, where there were 19 marine pictures, if you call them marine. One of the main things about this picture is that it is painted by someone who understood yachts and yachting. Kaibot was a committed sailor. He designed his own yachts. In fact, we see in this picture his own yacht called Cool Blanc. So there's a deep understanding of what he's painting. This is very close to the house that he bought, which is about 200 yards from this spot, Petit Jean de Villiers, across from Argenteuil. We can see in the background here the Chateau Michelet, it's as well known, the factories. This is a precise spot that we can definitely determine. This picture for me is a very beautiful, pure Impressionist painting. It's not so much Renoir's light feathery touch. This is thicker brush strokes, a heavier impasto, a more flickering surface, catching the light and particularly as a yachtsman, Kaibot would be very aware of light on water. And this is perhaps one of the outstanding features of this picture. There's a joy in the way that he's painted it. Yachting close to his heart, just close to his home, a favorite subject. It is very much a classic Kaibot. It is a picture I've known for over 30 years and it has remained in my mind, very clear over that period. It is a wonderful experience for me to have it now to be able to offer to a new collector. Tefaf is coming to New York. This is a big moment in the art market. It will be a wonderful fair showing in the armory on Park Avenue. It will be the best art in the best location at the best time and we think the best clientele will be there so we expect it to be a great success. Mm -hmm.